Many diseases develop and progress slowly over time. For example, diabetes and cardiovascular diseases associated with obesity. Clinical measures such as blood pressure, body mass index, glucose, lipids and cholesterol levels provide information on disease risk and status but do not tell the complete story. Ideally, we would like to look inside organs and tissues to know how the activity of the molecular processes change over time. Unraveling of the underlying molecular changes is important to be able to diagnose, treat and prevent such diseases. This becomes increasingly feasible with modern technologies. Metabolic processes in, for example, the liver are connected via networks. The activity in these networks is referred to as the metabolic flux. The processes are dynamic and fluxes change in time. They can increase or decrease after a meal, but also change as a result of a disease. Computational models can help in understanding these complex networks. Experimental data is used to make predictions about processes that cannot be measured. At the Eindhoven University of Technology, a computational method has been developed to simulate the progression of metabolic diseases. This method, called ADAPT, integrates experimental data from longitudinal studies with computer simulations. ADAPT identifies the processes that are disturbed and collectively induce the disease. In this way, we can propose molecular mechanisms involved in the disease. One example is the identification of a malfunctioning liver receptor resulting in disturbance of cholesterol metabolism. Such information can be used for the development of therapies, improved diagnosis and prevention.